Can you believe we're now 50 days into the NFL's Where to Play offseason training program? So today's training focus will be on body control. Body control throughout the movements today will be a challenging component to the training. Because yes, we're going to demand from you to have more of a pop in your training, but the pop doesn't mean that we lose control or lose focus on maintaining proper posture. As it relates to our game, yeah, you want to be aggressive and play with a lot of intent, but you have to do so under control. So let's be under control in today's training and get ready to play some football. In the Pendulay row, we're gonna set up into a regular athletic hinge, and we wanna maintain this hinge as we explosively pull the bar. The key is not allowing the hips and the shoulders to rise when you're explosively pulling on the bar. Make sure you're staying in control of your body as the bar is explosively pulled up and as it goes down back to the box. In the bench press, as always, we always wanna get on the bench in a nice five point contact position with our feet, our butt, our back, and our head. Control the bar on the way down, but we really wanna get that explosive thrust, that concentric thrust on the way back up. The key is we're not allowing our body to fly off the bench as we're driving the bar back up. So as you can see, everything's controlled even though we're coming down slow and exploding on the way up. Similar to the bench press, here what we're doing is we're doing a bench press on the ground. And the key is when we're absorbing the ball, we don't wanna allow our elbows to hit the ground. We wanna stop it right before it hits the ground, explode it right back up. But the key is to control your arm movement. If you don't control your arm movement, the med ball could possibly hit the partner or go in front of you and hit yourself. Control the movement on the way down and up, but remember, the explosion is controlled. In the med ball circle slam, what we're doing is challenging the core while staying in the hinge position. This circular force that we're creating is gonna to wanna to try to open you up and make you lose that body control. What we're doing here is keeping everything tight to our center of mass as we do the circle slam and staying in the hinge position. Remember, body control is key. This is our last movement for the day. Make sure you focus on body control in all these movements and you'll get the results that you're looking for.